Good evening. Welcome to dot programming dot com. This is my website, and I uh, today I'm talking about the bind text box and label control from database table record using entity framework, or you can say the EDMX file. So first of all, prepare the form for binding ok now add the edmx file write write new item ad.net entity data model first of all check the database table which is inside in SQL server in the add edmx file create the connection open SQL server Check the name of the server name and paste it here in the Visual Studio local DB version 11.0. Yeah, database name is 2NDB. Prepare connection. Yeah, connection is okay check the database name in the SQL server student db yeah that is student db exist here select top 1000 rows yeah student name is Jacob, Jacob and Bill and father's name is Smith, Bill, Bill Smith and Smith then record is here and open Visual Studio Entity Data Framework select for Entity Data Model TVO student record press ok, ok now your uh, ADMX file is successfully added into your solution and your diagram of uh, ADMX file displayed yeah your diagram is here ok now close it and check your edmx file in the solution yeah that is your edmx file is added successfully that is your model class it's similar with the, your table which is inside in database <coughs> so now prepare the form label control enter id Add a text box here. Okay, button get record. Oops, uh, now your ID is primary key. So enter not a student ID, your ID. So enter a student ID. So, oops, ID. Also add a 
some label and text box for getting the record like student ID, student name, father name and address label here change the text property of the label So add the text box uh, for address use multi-line text box So change the name property of the text box. the record uh, using the link query so first of all create the object of the uh, context class so first of all add a variable that is type of integer id text equals to id text dot text now add the object of the context of the class that is context class is student db entities So student db entities dc equals to dc for data context new student db entities by the help of public property which is inside is student db entities create a variable uh, type variable get records dc dot student get record dot where use lambda expressions for getting the single record a a dot id is double equals to and that is id uh, by which we can get uh, from the text box dot single or default okay uh, by using the single or default 
we can get only the single record at a time convert dot to integer because the id dot text uh, written as a text and explicitly not convert uh, sorry implicitly not convert by compiler so change by the help of explicitly convert convert dot to integer 32 so student i uh, student id text is a text box name dot text get record is a variable name that get the record of the student id so similarly all the record bind from the get record variable that variable access all the properties the model class and model class access the properties from the database okay So get record dot mother name address text dot text equals to get record dot address. one as a id a record is getter successfully mother name is not displayed here because uh, the table does not contain the mother name the id of the one is not contain the mother name address is also null and mother name is also null so it's not getting a get into the text boxes That is errors uh, again done it for the second record second record yeah mother names not appear when we apply to one mother name and address is not there yeah because the mother name address is null pass it here all the data leave the mother name because the mother name is also null in the three 